Hi. Wireframes are really cool these days. Unbound. Free. Unshackled. Not bound, in other words. In the most powerful cars. Cars we don't pay for. <clears throat> You go where Never we pay for your car, it's terrible. When we want. As fast as we want. You may call us thugs, but deep down, you know you need us. We are the law. You can't catch devils with angels. I am not you. I am the life you're too scared to live. You are asleep. What? I am awake. I am the reality show, the catalyst, the 15th I don't think you should ever bang yourself as a reality show. Nobody likes that. You want to know why I do this? I want to know why you don't. We are the enemy of freedom. I will run. We are the shadow you can I will shoot. never stop. We will hunt you. You will never catch me. You will not stop. You will make me We are fail. You will fail. You will break. You are my challenge. You are our enemy. You are our target. You are my rival. You are my life. <clears throat> there is, of course, a story in this game because it's not enough to just drive around as a car. You are the person in the car. Welcome to Need for Speed Rivals. Before we let you loose in Redview County, we'll need to take you through the basics. Select Cop or Racer to begin your training. Uh, that voice you might recognize is the same voice as Faith in Mirror's Edge. Um, because she has a very Californian flat tone to her voice, I guess. Uh, let's start as Racer. This is your hideout. They can be found all across <clears throat> Redview County, and they are the only place you'll be safe from the cops. We have hideouts all across the county. We'll you be need safe to take the fight in all these obvious hideouts. Why do we have so many hideouts? We should just find one good one. This is your speed list, the core of your rivalry. Here you will be able to choose from a constantly changing set of objectives that suit your driving style. You're only just getting started, so for now choice is limited. Once you complete your training, You'll be able to choose from multiple speed lists and shape your own destiny. 
So the speed lists are pretty cool because a lot of issues that arise from an open world game, maybe even an open world racing game, is that you are a little directionless and you don't know what to do, you don't have easy objectives. And this is sort of a really compact list of objectives for you to go through, I like that. Um, just a couple of things to hit and then return and restart that sequence of getting more uh, objectives bit by bit. So you're not overwhelmed with a thousand objectives and uh, just completing each one of these at a time is kind of satisfying, it gets you more points. So since it's the training app, just like this one, I don't have a choice. Your hideout is your garage and tuning shop all in one. You can choose your car, pursuit tech, personalization options, and performance upgrades. Take a look around, and when you're ready, we'll hit the road. This is the built-in streaming from the PS4, that's correct. That's why I'm trapped in this little box here. <clears throat> and this is actually the PlayStation Eye camera. This is where your cars are kept. New cars will become available as you complete speed lists, and your rank increases. You can then use your speed points to buy cars. So in other words, you complete objectives, you earn speed points, and with those you can purchase new cars and new uh, gadgets for those cars. So I'm pretty much stuck with this Porsche for now. Um, you have two can pursuit, pursuit tech, tech slots available. It. When you've earned enough speed points, select a slot to buy and equip pursuit tech for each of your vehicles. And these are things like uh, EMP pulses. Uh, this one's pretty useful, the shockwave. Uh, it actually pushes cars away from you. And this comes into play when the cops are particularly uh, adamant about catching you. This is where yeah, you make course. your car Personalize your own. the car. Personalize your vehicle in many different ways. Paints, in many different rims, ways. liveries, Paints, rims, decals, liveries, wraps, decals, and license, wraps plates. And license plates. The choice is yours. The choice is yours. There are plenty of options, and we can make this Porsche pretty hideous if we wanted to. But I couldn't live with myself if I did that. And I would endorse the police officers arresting me on the spot. Let's go with a nice red. Ugh. Keep it simple since we're, we're just starting out. Yes, I'm seeing the game in a smaller window. Um, I can increase it to full screen, but then I can't see any questions or comments. See, now that's nice. It's only 10,000 speed points. Change the license plate. Once and of course, you start performance speed upgrades. points, you can buy upgrades to improve your vehicle performance. Um, these are relatively simple. Uh, I also like this. It's not, you know, uh, on par with a game like Forza. You don't have to. You don't have to worry about technical stuff. Uh, it's just uh, top speed, acceleration, control, strength, and durability, which is actually really important because a lot of people ran into you in this game. This county is beset by terrible drivers. It's generally pretty lawless out there. Uh, while you're in this garage, this you can is actually map of move County. to the map. Here you'll be able to see other drivers, the events that are open, and also choose your start location. For now, we'll start just outside. I'm gonna make it real confusing and change the to metric. And Overwatch is actually a connection to uh, Need for Speed. Um, the app, so people can play and look at the map through the app. It's pretty nice. There are some X Criterion people who worked on this game. I believe the creative director is originally from Criterion. 
Alright, let's just get out of the garage. Finally. There's no one else in my game session right now because the PlayStation Network is having some issues, but we will. I'll, I'll check a, a little bit later, right after this tutorial section, see if anyone else is playing, because that's when the game gets really cool. You're all set to free drive. On the right of your screen, you'll see the speed list you chose earlier. Complete the objectives in the speed list to complete your training. You can set a route to any destination by pulling up the map or using Easy Drive in the top left of your screen. Let's go. And here we go. We're starting. To start a race, simply pull up at the start location and press the button. You can start an event at any time, even when you're being chased by the cops. Just make sure to drive slow enough to not blast by it. You can also start head-to-head -head races at any time by getting close to another driver and pressing the same button. Right, so I just started a race, you just press one button, L1, when you're close to it. earns you speed points and increases your multiplier at the top of the screen. It also raises your heat level. The higher your heat level, the harder the cops will try and chase you down. The cops have found you. Time to get out of here. Cops will chase you down and try to bust you any way they can. If you get busted, you will lose your speed points and your multiplier. To outrun the cops, drive fast and use the mini-map at the bottom left of your screen to avoid them and escape. So I'm seeing here that uh, you guys are preferring to turn the volume down if you the video game is too loud for you because you're old. How's that? Is that better? Is that preferable? Escape bar at the bottom of the screen shows your progress. If the cop catches up to you during this time, the pursuit will resume. Reach heat level three, so that's interesting. It's a multiplier every time you complete an objective. Your multiplier goes up, um, and you earn more speed points. However, you can only keep the speed points if you make it back to your hideout and bank them. If you become arrested or if you are beaten in a race by another online player, they get your points. You lose everything. So a pretty interesting uh, risk reward structure. Um, 
can be very frustrating I think if you lose a lot of points, but um, it's fun earning them, so it's a good way to keep going with the game. And uh, what's really cool is the different events um, or the different challenges can overlap, so you can drive by someone, press the L1 button to, to challenge them, and we can race. Uh, at which point you may also become pursued by the police and engage in the pursuit event. So all the events can overlap the staff. You can cross people who are participating in events of their own in their own way, um, and collide with them, even physically. Uh, no performance issues yet, it's running pretty well, it's just really great for me to actually find another racer so I can check them. about performance issues with the game or the cost of the game. Power seems to be performing fine. Alright, missing L1, beginning and end of this guy. Okay, that's it. That's all you have to do. your speed list. Time to head back to the hideout and bank your speed points. You can use the map or easy drive in the top left of the screen to set a route directly to the nearest hideout, repair shop, any event, or other players. Walt Jordan is suggesting that we obey traffic rules and regulations. So, as I return to my hideout, I will attempt to do so. So you can use it an in-game GPS. You press right on the D-pad. So if you look at the top left, you'll see there are, there's a menu thing. And you can pick the nearest hideout and it will automatically map that on the GPS. So I have to do a U-turn, I'm sorry. That's really good. So uh, carefully driving back to the bank the wall. Alright, I'm probably driving too far. Alright, so There should be a trophy for this, it's actually quite challenging. I should point out that I was not required to take it out of here before this game started. I don't know whether anyone do it. So my hideout is on the left here. Ooh, I broke something. You stop here, you bank the money that you've earned. And that's it. And then you get a trophy. You finished your racer training. Now switch to a cop to know your rival. It's important to know how your rivals are thinking. Play the cop training now. So we're going to be trained as a police officer now. Um, I think the storyline of this game is that you are a criminal who is so uh, ridden by guilt that he develops a split personality and attempts to capture himself. Welcome to the Redview County Police Department. This is one of many RCPD mobile command posts spread throughout the county. It's also where you'll start your training. This is your assignment for today. When you have completed your training, you will be able to choose from a constantly changing set of assignments that add different pursuit vehicles to your command post. I think uh, this is most like Need for Speed Most Wanted in terms of the structure of the overworld, um, but in terms of how, how often you or chased Inside by the police, your command and how post, you can, can play as the police. Car, I would say Need for Speed Hot Pursuit is a plate. good match, and unit. I mean both versions of that game. Uh, but probably more recently, the Criterion version. Each pursuit vehicle comes in three different variations patrol, enforcer, and undercover, each with their own style. The vehicle you earn depends on the type of assignment you complete. 
So you can do it in different kinds of police vehicles, uh, especially like the undercover ones. Because um, they don't seem particularly effective at being undercover. But we'll just go with this one. Uh, get out of the garage as quickly as possible. This is your RCPD map of Redview County. Here you'll be able to see other cops, <clears throat> track racers, and see the events that are open. So you can it start at specific points, and you, you can also start, start right on one of the available events. When you've completed your training, you'll be able you to deploy to any command quite post. Large. Go all the way down here. You're ready for your first patrol. Displayed on the right is your assignment for today. Complete the objectives in the assignment to complete your training. You can set a route to any destination by pulling up the map or using Easy Drive in the top left of your screen. This is my Mercedes uh, police officer car. It's gonna get going. To start any event, Pull up to the start location and press the button. Your goal in a rapid response is to drive the RCPD. Does it use the camera for any features? Not that I have noticed. Um, I believe you can take a picture of yourself with a speed network on, on, on the website. Uh, and it will display the picture on the ground. Because you're responding to something, so you are allowed to place. I guess I can turn around. I'm sorry. I guess we're free range today. Like that. Like this. Like that. It's all in the name of the book. your path at any time in Redview County. To start a pursuit, press the button to turn on your lights, and the pursuit <clears> begins. <throat> if you hit a racer, or they hit you, the chase will also start. That's right, if you, if you just touch a police officer, the chase will start. The I'm pursuing this person. To chase them down and hit them with your vehicle until they crash out. Or use pursuit tech to bring them down once it becomes available. First day racer, the, the more speed points you will earn. You can use these speed points to acquire and upgrade new pursuit tech back at the command post. Congratulations. You I am streaming directly from the PlayStation 4. Time to yes. head back to the command post. You can use the map or easy drive in the top left of the screen to set a route directly to the nearest command post, repair shop, any event, or other players. Oh, that person is saving it's probably just a racer that was first job. Racer busted and probably in the wrong. Just doing my job. Right, so I have to go back to command post. Select 
select the nearest one first on the top left. Here. Jordan, I would say the soundtrack has fallen down a significant amount of dubsteps, um, but it did not injure itself, so... Every time you, you get a new car, or a new car becomes available to purchase, you watch one of these videos, which is sort of like a lurid look at every car up close. Very voyeuristic, exciting, because you know cars are You really completed attractive. your training. Welcome to the RCPD. Now you can jump into Redview County. You've completed your training. Now pick a side and take the fight to And you can right. switch between sides um, every time you are in a hideout. So if you if you come back as a racer, you can easily switch over to uh, being a cop, and you have different careers and points for each of those. So I'm going to go back to being a racer because I like being illicit and uh, pursued. Sign me in again. I will be right back. <laughs> 